So these are the biggest mistakes that law firms make when trying to market themselves on Google. So the very first thing I see all the time is that they're all saying the same thing. Now, if you go on Google and search a law firm in your area or anywhere for that matter, they all say exactly the same thing. 20 years experience, you know, top law firm in whatever area, et cetera, et cetera. It's literally the exact same thing. And they're just hoping that people click on their law firm and buy from them and use their service. And that is not the way to guarantee amazing results. You need to try and stand out somehow, make some kind of offer that actually stands out to people, not just says exactly what all your competitors are saying as well, because that is what happens. And so number one is exactly that. If you're trying to market yourself, try and stand out in some way make some kind of offer to your potential clients. I mean, a lot of them do free 15 minute consultations. I've seen that a lot. A problem is that everyone offers that now. So you need to now do something else that's maybe just priced in a slightly different way or like addresses some kind of pain point. But that's definitely the biggest problem I see all the time. The second one is with Google ads, targeting all kinds of random informational keywords. So uh, let's just go Google ads info keywords. And what this means is people run ads for things like, do I need a lawyer for a divorce? Or can I make a contract without a lawyer? Things like that, right? And these keywords are very unlikely to convert into paying matters and actually be profitable because these people are at the informational gathering stage. Now you wanna target these people with SEO content, but you don't wanna pay for clicks for these because they're unlikely to actually lead to any money for your firm from the ad campaign. And so that's something you wanna be aware of, especially if you're not just doing a branding exercise and you have tens of thousands of dollars to spend on ads and you don't really care, then you just wanna show up, then that's fine. But if you're on a limited budget, let's say a few thousand dollars a month or something like that, you wanna make sure that you're actually highly targeting your keywords on Google to only show up to people who specifically need a lawyer now because that's gonna convert a lot better and you're gonna get a much better ROI and a lot more matters coming in from that specifically. Now, number three is sending people to the home page. Now, that is again a Google ads mistake where they run Google ads and they say it's like family lawyer near me or something like that and you click on it and then it takes people to the home page where you, it lists out all the different services and just generally talks about the law firm and people don't care about that and that doesn't convert very well either. You wanna make sure that you're sending them to a specific page that's actually targeting whatever it is they came through. So if it's, let's say, a commercial lawyer or a certain type of, let's say, commercial law, let's say, like, insolvency lawyer, you want to send them to a page that just talks about insolvency and all the different parts of insolvency that you can help them with. You don't want to send them to a general thing about how we offer commercial law and family law and criminal. Nobody cares about that stuff. Like, someone who's just been arrested and needs a criminal lawyer or is being charged doesn't care that you're offering commercial law. You need to give them exactly what they want and address those specific pain points and, and how you can help them with their specific type of matter. And that's gonna convert far better than if you run it to a generic homepage that just generally gives them information because nobody cares, that's the truth of the matter. And now number four is not targeting info content with SEO. So I'm just gonna go SEO info content. And so what I mean by that is, earlier I mentioned with the Google ads, people target, ironically, info keywords with the Google ads. So like, do I need a lawyer uh, for a divorce and things like that? And then they don't target them with SEO, which is exactly where you should be targeting them because you don't pay for that traffic and it's essentially free. And so that's where you want to target those with the different, let's say blog articles and content pieces that answer these questions and build trust with the people who read them. So then they'll come back to you when they do need a lawyer and they're much more likely to use your services. And so there's thousands and thousands of these info type searches and questions that people look for on Google every month regarding basically every remotely popular area of law. And you should be targeting those with content because then you're going to show up. You're going to start building brand trust and authority on Google search. People are going to start recognizing your firm and it's going to snowball from there and you're going to build up a lot of momentum and get a lot more leads and traffic. And as a result, more matters for your firm. So that's how you want to do that. These are probably the four biggest mistakes I see with law firms trying to market themselves on Google. And honestly, they're quite detrimental. If you can get all these right, then you can exponentially grow your firm as I have done for about half a dozen law firms to get ridiculous amount of leads every month and make a lot of money. So that's basically it. If you want me to implement what I know about Google and getting more matters, for law firms for you on a pure performance basis and help you make at least a million or more additional income for your firm per year, you can click the link in the description below and you can book a call with me through my website and I'll see how I can help. Talk then.